mic. Just the dude I needed to talk to. Look, I was gonna call you earlier, but I was in this meeting and I, and I had to finish it. Damn, Mike, hold on, man. Yo, I called you. Look, Mike, I need a favor, all right? Bro, whatever it is, I got you, man. Don't even trip. So you remember Malika, right? Of course you remember Malika. Yeah, man. So she gonna have a nerve to come over to the crib last night and then gonna fall asleep. What's the issue with that? Talking about, oh, I'm tired, my feet hurt, oh, I just need to take a 20 minute nap. Mike, man, you yeah. my you my dog, but you wrong, man. Let me tell you what happened. All right, man, tell me what happened. So I'm up there watching Sports Center last night, right? And then I'm, oh, are you serious? You can't even hit. Not right now. Later tonight. Uh, baby, I need you. We both need you. Just want to twenty minute nap, baby. Look me up. Well, you know, I had a hard day too, you know. Malik. Malik. I'm not playing. I'm about to leave somewhere. You gotta you know go what? now. I'm getting really tired of your mood swings. Mood swings? You're not just gonna talk just to me. Just get the hell out of my apartment now! You know, you've been real extreme lately. I'm really tired of this. Goodbye. You're wrong. Look, man. You my dog and all, but you're wrong, man. You're wrong. Come and get back and get your lady. Yeah, whatever. You're only saying that because it ain't happening to you. Besides, man. So. All right. So, what's up for tonight? Tonight, man. You know what tonight is. Our annual blackjack and coconut. All right. Cool, cool. Okay. You're going to be there, right? Tell me Derek's kind of cool. Yeah, man. They come at 9 o'clock, man. Don't be late, all right? Yeah, man. I'll be all here. Right. Hey, Mike. Hi. What up, what up? Babe, Mike's here. 
Hey, what up? What up, man? What up, bro? 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 What Nothing for your ass. You know you can't handle no kind of liquor. I don't remember the last time this fool had a drink. <laughs> we still got the pictures on Instagram. Yo, he's right. Yo, man, that fool's crazy. Hey, Mike, you ready for this ass with me? The question is, are you all ready for this ass with me? Because I came here with a lot of money in my pocket, and I plan to come back with some more. You can't hear with a lot of talking to. Whatever, man. Just deal with the cards, bro. Now, what we got here? What we got? What we got? Something you want to say to me, Mike? Nah, nah, I'm good. I do that. Don't start your shit. Look, and I ain't starting no shit, man. I just want to ask. All right, can I? Can I ask the question? Please. <laughs> <laughs> so, Tiffany, every week you throw my man a poker game. Every week you throw my man a poker game. Send him to some kind of strip club. Then you turn around and you act like you cool with it. And we all know you really not. So what you doing for me? Oh, I know. It's probably those expensive handbags my man be getting. Mike. Mike. So what you doing for, Tiffany? Mike. So what you doing for, Tiffany? Mike. Man, still stuck on that Wait, shoe, no. Our yeah. relationship is built on compromise. Mm -hmm. I understand my role, and Jay understands his. That's what we reflect on. And I don't want my man to be anything else other than my man. You know what your problem is? You keep judging all women by the actions of some. Hell, black women. Women are like most of creatures, man. They just want to feel understood. They want to know you actually listen to communicate effectively. It's like, for real, if your brothers understood that, they would notice you know, how much control they have. It's based on how comfortable women in relationship. What you laughing at, man? For real. <laughs> Yo, man, what the hell is this fool talking about? That's way over my head, bro. Listen, listen. Most women inject in a relationship is gain what? Green. Right? If men knew that, shit, we get in the shit they desire in the relationship they want. We get the sex and the compassion in return. And I know you want that sex. You <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> trying, yo. <laughs> Alright, alright. I, I feel you. I feel you, bro. Alright. Man, we talking about today's women, bro. Oh, gold diggers, money grubbers, sack chasers. Nah, man. Mm. That's not what I'm saying. Okay, no, 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 no. Now, it all depends on the relationship. Not all women are the same. Okay, we lost this. <laughs> oh, he's with yeah, he's gone. Man. So, sucker for love. For man. Hey, Mike. I'm a happy married man. Oh, really? You're a happily married man? Mm hmm. Your ass here playing cards with three of your boys. You are awesome. Oh, I'm sorry. Except for my man. What? My, like I said, I'm a happily married man. Don't get me wrong. I enjoy going out with Doc. You like she enjoys her break with Doc? My wife satisfies all my needs. What? Yeah. Bro, there ain't no woman on this green earth that can satisfy all my needs. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Baby, you okay? That's not Look, man, I'm just saying, man. I just don't feel like there's a woman out there who can satisfy all my needs. All my needs? Yeah. I mean, if there is, I ain't never met her. And you know why I haven't met her? Why is because that? her ass don't exist. That's why. It's this idiot. It had been dropped on this head. Yo, you yeah. know what? I think you're right. You can see on that side. Oh, yeah. 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 Just put your money I on. ain't got time for this nonsense. This very man is about to go home to his wife. Okay. So you just gonna leave as soon as I get here? Yep. Yeah. You don't lose your money. That's why. We <laughs> should say so, bro. Yeah. Oh, all right, man. All right, Brian, man. Hey, I'm gonna see you at the shop next week, all right? You gotta go home to the master. You gotta tend and field. You gotta go on now. Go on now. Get your wife in. <laughs> oh, hell. I fold. Nah, ain't, ain't too much, man. Checking these ties. What you got going on? 
Yeah, man. Not too much, man. But probably last night, man. <laughs> so too much. Money. Right, man. He just, you know, needs somebody to take his mind off the leaker, that's all. Nah, I don't know about all that. Jay, you need to talk to him. <laughs> well, look, it's funny you said it because me and Tiffany were just talking about him last night. And I don't know. She thinks there's really something wrong with him. Like, seriously. Oh, the whole situation with him and Malika. Damn, I mean, ain't it been like that about a year though? I think it was longer than a year. Like, going on two. I think it was going on two years, matter of fact. Ah, uh, damn. Before that, he was messing with a bunch of women in our relationship. <laughs> God, man, I know. I know. He might be forget around. He needed to do something on somebody. Like that. Like, really. I would look well. I'll hit up Tiffany. Hopefully, she can make something happen and maybe we can get to work out. Oh, what's up, man? Chillin', chillin', man. 
crazy. I got to come to your job. Let's get a hold of you. Working like a Hebrew slave. Yeah. yeah. Just to listen to you, right? That one's in my garage. That I. I'm serious about this. Oh, yeah, man. Definitely. Most definitely. I take a look at it. I know you're going to take a look at that, but listen. Mm-hmm. You really need to get your, get your mind off the thing. So, so listen, I know, look, just listen, I know. Being more than talking, you think you're going to be somebody to get your mind off the oh, man, I ain't about to, I'm cool, man. Mm-hmm. No, 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 I ain't ready to be dating no other chicken head. Look, hear me out. Tiff, you stop me right there. And you know me and Tiff don't get along. Why would I even I, date one of our listen, friends, man? Listen, you're single and she's single. Why not try it out? What's the worst that can happen? What she look like? She's a trap. Trust me, Joe. Look, listen, I got you, okay? I'm going to set it up, and I'm going to take some information later on, all right? Don't worry about it, all right? Man. Don't always, like, keep the same time. Do me right. I got you, man. <laughs> we here? I have no idea. <laughs> well, you can blame Tiffany, okay? Those are the favorites that we do for friends. Yeah, no, tell me about it. Honestly, I thought we'd be meeting somewhere, you know, somewhere like a bar or a restaurant, you know, somewhere that serves something other than a cup of coffee. Mm-hmm. Well, word on the streets is that you do like bars, so. So my reputation perceives itself. Oh, yeah. Okay. Do you drink? No, actually, I don't drink, nor do I smoke, hmm. just in case you were wondering. You from here? Well, I guess I can't consider this home now because I've been here for like seven years or so. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm from here. Okay. So, uh, you moved here alone? No, actually. Um, I was engaged, uh, when I moved here. Oh, so you're divorced? Well, I'm not divorced. Um, my fiance ended up calling the engagement off. Oh, wow. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, um, I guess it just wasn't meant to be, you know? What happened? I mean, if you don't mind, I mean, I don't want to cry or anything. Well, you are taking me down memory lane, but, um, I actually had a miscarriage, you know, and as most relationships do, we try to keep our foundation together. So, you know, our faith was strong. And not long after that, I ended up pregnant again. Then I had a stillbirth. Oh, your fiance, was he support? Like that, but my faith in the Lord is why I was able to get through it. You know, so I'm thankful for that. Wow. Uh, you want to get some fresh air? <laughs> <laughs> you want to go for a walk? Hey. Okay. Oh, Miss Katrina. Please enlighten What are your thoughts about me? Goodness, Mike. I definitely didn't put my hair to pick a mic. Oh, no. Honestly. I'm really enjoying our conversation. Yeah, really. But um, you're definitely not off the hook, okay? I want to know why you're single. I just recently got out of a relationship. Really? Mm-hmm. Really? She... 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 Stop. Lack of communication. Really? Mm-hmm. So you never felt the need to just maybe reach out to her, talk to her about you felt, any of that? No, not really. Are you close to any women in your life? Your mom? Anybody? <sighs> my mother's boyfriend was beating on me when I was young. But I saw him. Mm-hmm. So he kicked me out. She didn't want to leave or anything? She was so caught up all the material stuff that he was buying. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like, he took about us out of a bad environment. Mm-hmm. Roach infested house, bad plumbing. I guess that shadowed her judgment because she just wouldn't leave. I, I'm sorry, I, I just didn't know that. I mean, I... She'd rather put her own son out. Leave that to Um, okay. I'm not gonna be all right. Look at me. I'm middle aged. I don't have any family. 
no kids, no wife. I consume myself in my work, and all I do is drink to death. Ooh, ooh, no, I'm not going to be a wait, wait, Mike. Where's your faith? Yeah, you got. You have got to at some point figure out a way to let this go. Do you understand that our Lord Jesus Christ, He is faithful? Do you understand that? Look, I'm not the same person I was today that I was fucking ten years ago. But I don't let my past dictate who I am. Do you see me? Take a good look at me, because I am a walking testimony. Me, Katrina. And the father that we serve, he loves you. He loves you, Mike. Do you understand that? Tell me love. But you gotta stand on his word. Do you understand me? I am who I am today because of his word. And you have to, you have to stand on that. You have to trust him. Because I am who I am today because of that. Because he is love. God is love, Mike. He's love. Yes, I speak to Mary, please. Mom? Thank you. 